Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It's time now for the nation's sharpest opinion. Rahul Gandhi has compared Modi's model of governance with the British era. Ladies and gentlemen, Rahul Gandhi. The great-grandson of Nehru. The great-great-grandson of Motilal Nehru. Is trying to get preachy about the British Raj. Before I even begin the rest of the nation's sharpest opinion, and since Rahul Gandhi has such problems with inequality in India and how some people have become so rich and some people have become so poor, I want Rahul Gandhi to go and ask anyone in his extended family, how did Motilal Nehru become so rich? during the British time. What was Motilal Nehru's lifestyle which, about which fables are written? What was Motilal Nehru's working relationship with the British at that time? Was Motilal Nehru very close to the British? Did he benefit by being close to the British? Did he prosper by being close to the British? And Rahul Gandhi, let me go further. Your great-grandfather Nehru, what was his lifestyle pre-independence? When the people of India were being exploited, when the people of India were very poor, what was your great-grandfather Nehru and your great-great-grandfather Motilal Nehru's lifestyle, riches, money, assets, gold, jewellery? You know Rahul Gandhi, it used to be told, it was fables at that point of time about how your family made so much money under the British, under the British, not after the British. After the British, of course, many fold you people made money. But under the British, just check it out. Nehru, so close to Edwina, so close to the Mountbatten's, what kind of parties happened at that point of time? How were they all fetted around? Go check it out. The same Nehru who was acting on Mountbatten's advice on Kashmir. The same family, ladies and gentlemen, who seem to have inherited and mastered, in my view, the ability to play classic British Raj politics of divide and rule and trying to lecture New India about inequality. The same Rahul Gandhi, whose government allowed the abide with me him to play at the beating retreat year after year after year, the same Rahul Gandhi. Whose father reportedly made religion a filter as a basis for induction into the Central Parliamentary Board. The same Rahul Gandhi whose mother headed a UPA which reportedly sanctioned a survey to find out the number of Muslims in the Indian Army. The same Rahul Gandhi whose manifesto is ridden with the divide and rule is lecturing India. On the one side you are saying we are going to try our best to get more Muslims into the higher judiciary. Same divide and rule. But beyond that ladies and gentlemen. I will tear apart this argument of inequality that Rahul Gandhi has begun to spin. Because beyond the British obsession of Rahul Gandhi, some facts need to be put on the record to this family. That is my view. So I'll conclude by saying one thing. Rahul Gandhi, start doing your research and your homework. Find out how rich your family was under the British. If anybody benefited under the British, Rahul Gandhi, it was your family. So oh, introspect, do a PhD on your family's wealth pre-independence and then speak.